You know, something that a lot of people don't realize is that when you're a newer band or a younger band like us, you have to do a lot of the loading in and loading out like pretty much all by yourself. So me and my brothers not only play the show, but then we load in and load out. So <laughs> 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 it's too sandy out here. Bad news over here. We got a crack in our trailer hitch. We might lose the trailer on the way home. We'll see. Who are we gonna send to get it? Or oh, rent a truck. Here. Rent a truck today if we can rent a truck to, to do it from here, you know, and not worry about it. And then take it take it where? <laughs> home. Right. A truck all the way home? A, a U haul or, or a rider truck to to pull it. We're bouncing down the road, you know, what's he gonna do? Snap. Oh man. Going like this. But maybe we get to uh oh, it's the trailer going on. How do you think this broke? Well I have no idea. <laughs> I think that's broke. How much would it cost to rent a U-Haul and drive it across America? <laughs> well, yeah, and deliver From it. From New Hampshire to Atlanta. Probably wouldn't be cheap. A main issue right now? the fact that I'm hungry. <laughs> so hunger needs to be handled and then figure out the bus and trailer. That's my to-do list. We decided it's probably a bad idea to try to bring the, to go home with the trailer hitch the way it is because if the trailer falls off and kills somebody, we'll feel pretty bad about that. So we found a guy here that says he thinks he can weld it back together. So he's got a little shop right down the road, but it's like, over this little hill and I really don't know if the bus is gonna fit up there and we might fall off the side of a mountain trying to get it in there but if we can get the bus to his shop he's had to weld it so let's see if we can get it in there so listen Zach yeah look in that mirror you see so that hill we're going up? oh shoot so we gotta back all the way down there and up through this really tight part so if you want to hop out and guide me that'd be helpful he, he said we had to go back there? yeah Jake too um, hey, let me know if I'm gonna hit that telephone wire, okay? Okay. Oh yeah, that telephone wire is pretty low. I know. Nah, you shouldn't hit it though. You see where it gets real tight over there? Oh yeah, that's what I'm nervous about. This is the, this is the part I'm nervous about right here. Yeah. Keep coming. Nope. No, don't stay too close to that side yet. What side? That left side. Well, I don't know. You're probably looking alright. I'm all right, trying keep to, coming. I gotta hug that left side. Easy peasy. I could have done this with my eyes closed. Not really. Remember, I drove the bus once forward on the highway and I was terrified. <laughs> well, this is a piece of junk. Can you see the crack? Right, right there. That's crack. It's all rusted out. This is not the first time this happened to us. It's a pretty big crack. Last time it happened, this crack. Then it cracked right here and here. And the whole deal just whoop, fell down hit the ground so we're trying to prevent that That's something you got to know about Nick is when he talks about cars or buses he he starts to sound like he works on NASA pit crew so NASA. we on the NASA pit crew on the NASA pit crew on the NASCAR on the NASCAR pit crew sorry I got SpaceX and Elon Musk on the mind no when Nick when Nick starts talk, when Nick starts talking about buses and, and cars or anything having to do with mechanics he he's, he goes real southern, right? He works for NASCAR. All right, man. NASA. He owns a owns a car and races it. Dad gum shoot. Yeah, crack. Yeah. It doesn't look terrible right now, but this has only been on here for about a month, and the last one cracked right there, and on these sides, the whole trailer is down. Dad gum shoot. It's not cold anymore. Thank I'm goodness. The jacket off. I really wonder why you went down 92. That's the way my GPS took me. As soon as you turn on 92, my GPS out of 15 minutes. Right? What are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do? Take hurry, hurry, hurry. 285, 535. That's what we're gonna do about it. <laughs> <laughs> How do you like that parking job? It's pretty good. This is what. New Hampshire does to everything. Just ruins everything. Everything's dirty. If you live in the north, I don't understand you. That's that's all I got to say. All right, man. This is pretty much what we do every single trip that we go on. 
to load all of our belongings, well, the majority of our belongings into a bus, all of our clothes, and then we come home with just as much stuff, if not more sometimes. This is the place. I want to do a tour sometime. Okay, Google, turn on the lights. Okay, turning on 13 lights. We live in a smart house, by the way.